you know, there's always things going on. If, if I'm not directly here, if I'm not giving tours or, or something like that, then generally I'm back over at the Camelot Veterinary Hospital. Um, but that's also where I, I butcher cows for, for the big cats. And um, a lot of farmers will actually, they'll actually donate um, cows to us, maybe cows that have, have um, had complications after having, a, after having a calf or maybe a cow that has broken its leg. Um, a lot of very unfortunate events for the cows, but um, rather than call the knacker or call somebody to come and pick the animal up to take it to dispose of the carcass, um, these people will actually call me to come and pick up a freshly, fresh cow um, to, to help utilize it for cat food. We feed about 200 pounds of deboned meat a day. Uh, a lot of, lot of it comes from the freshly roadkill deer that the Pennsylvania State Police call about, as well as the, the public will, will also call me. Of course, my friends and family, because they know that I'm just cat crazy. Um, <laughs> but the truth is I'm just very, very passionate about the big cats. So what do I care if I'm spotted on 119 several times a week picking up um, you know, freshly roadkill deer? I, I really don't. I don't even give it a thought.